In the heart of Africa's dynamic landscape, a wave of transformative construction projects is set to redefine the continent's infrastructure and economic trajectory in 2024. Backed by a coalition of international stakeholders, these ventures transcend borders, creating a network of interconnected developments aimed at fostering intra-African trade and investment. Meticulously designed for strategic impact, these projects go beyond mere structures. They represent a catalyst for local economic growth, job creation, and the fortification of energy security. With a keen eye on resource sharing and a collective influence on regional and global energy markets, these initiatives are not just construction endeavors. They are the architects of a future where Africa stands at the forefront of innovation and sustainable development. Join us as we unveil the top 10 construction projects completing in 2024 and witness the birth of a new era for the African continent. Number 10. The Lobito Corridor Angola The Lobito Corridor, a trans-regional infrastructure initiative connecting the southern DRC and northwestern Zambia to global trade via Angola's port of Lobito, is gaining momentum. Supported by the African Development Bank, Africa Finance Corporation, the U.S., and the European Union, this project aims to address logistical challenges in Southern Africa's mining sector. Recent developments include Lobito Atlantic Railway's $455 million investment in Angola for wagon and locomotive acquisitions, along with workforce training. An additional $100 million is allocated for the DRC, and potential future investments in Zambia are on the horizon. The project promises streamlined exports and economic growth and signals growing Western interest in Africa's mineral reserves. Number 9. Dangote Refinery, Nigeria The Dangote Refinery, poised to become Africa's largest with a remarkable daily capacity of 650,000 barrels, is a transformative venture set to redefine the continent's refining landscape. This colossal project encompasses a 435-megawatt power station, a deep seaport, and a fertilizer unit, showcasing its multifaceted impact. Though experiencing minor delays, the refinery is progressing towards operationalization in a phased approach, with the initial phase slated to commence in the first quarter of 2024. By 2025, it is expected to reach full operational capacity. Beyond resolving Nigeria's chronic fuel shortages, this refinery holds the promise of reducing petroleum costs and positioning the country as a regional refining hub. As a critical milestone in Nigeria's downstream infrastructure expansion, the Dangote refinery emerges as a beacon of progress, charting a course toward enhanced energy security and economic prosperity for the nation. Number 8. Lake Albert Development, Uganda the Lake Albert development in Uganda marks a pivotal moment in the country's energy landscape, featuring two significant upstream oil projects, the Total Energies operated Tilenga and the Kingfisher Project, overseen by China National Offshore Oil Corporation, CNOs. Anticipated to commence production in 2025, these ventures aim to collectively yield 230,000 barrels per day. Integral to this development is the construction of the East African Crude Oil Pipeline, EACOP, spanning 1,443 kilometers. The pipeline is designed to transport approximately 246,000 BPD from Uganda's Talenga and Kingfisher fields to Tanzania's port of Tanga, facilitating international exports and establishing Uganda as an emerging player in the global oil market. With key stakeholders including Total Energies, the Uganda National Oil Company, the Tanzania Petroleum Corporation, and Sino Os, the completion of the ECOP is on the horizon, set to reshape the dynamics of the region by 2025. Number 7. The Suez Canal Expansion, Egypt The Suez Canal, a vital maritime route, underwent an $8 billion expansion in 2015, proving lucrative for Egypt. In response to the ever-given incident in 2021, where a container ship blocked the canal, a $2 billion expansion project focused on widening and deepening the southern segment was initiated. Covering the southernmost 30 kilometers, 
the expansion widens the canal by 40 meters eastward and deepens it to 72 feet, improving navigation by 28%. Completed in July 2023, this effort aims to enhance Egypt's role as a key global shipping hub, fostering economic growth and geopolitical importance. The expanded Suez Canal is set to transform global shipping in 2024, facilitating smoother navigation and positively impacting trade across the continent, contributing to broader economic development in the region. Number 6. Punta Europa Gas Mega Hub, Equatorial Guinea. Equatorial Guinea's Punta Europa Gas Mega Hub is advancing its mission to establish an intra African gas trade network by expanding its existing infrastructure. The successful first phase linked the Chevron operated Allen Field to the Punta Europa Liquefied Natural Gas LNG terminal. The upcoming second phase, starting in January 2024, will integrate gas from the Marathon oil-operated Alba field, while the third phase focuses on commercializing gas from the Aseng field, operational since 2011. Number 5. MSGBC 225-kilowatt regional interconnection line, Senegal, the Gambia, Guinea-Bissau, and Guinea-Conakry. Recently commissioned, the 1,677-kilometer 225-kilowatt regional electricity interconnection line is a vital component of the Gambia River Basin Development Project spanning Senegal, the Gambia, Guinea-Bissau, and Guinea-Conakry. Collaboration among various utilities, including the Gambia National Water and Electric Company, Electricity of Guinea, Electricity and Water of Guinea-Bissau, and Senelec, has facilitated a regional energy exchange. Upon the project's full completion, which also involves constructing 15 electronic transformation stations, Guinea-Conakry and Guinea-Bissau will join their MSGBC counterparts in West Africa for energy sharing via the network. Number 4. Grand Ethiopian Renaissance Dam, Ethiopia The Grand Ethiopian Renaissance, located on the Blue Nile River near Ethiopia's border with Sudan, is a groundbreaking yet contentious infrastructure project in Africa. Priced at $5 billion, this massive dam aims to generate 6,000 megawatts of electricity annually, potentially positioning Ethiopia as a leading hydroelectric exporter on the continent. Funding for the GERD comes from internal crowdsourcing, including the sale of bonds and contributions from employees, with an additional $1 billion for turbines and electrical equipment financed by the Exim Bank of China. Despite its ambitious goals, the dam has sparked regional disputes, particularly with downstream nations like Egypt and Sudan, who express concerns about its impact on crucial water resources. Negotiations surrounding water usage and dam filling have strained diplomatic relations. However, once completed, the GRD holds the promise of significant benefits, including increased energy access for Ethiopia, potential enhancements to regional electricity grids, and economic development through surplus energy exports. Number 3. Internet Balloons in Zanzibar, Tanzania Tanzania faces low internet usage, with only 20% online, below the sub-Saharan African average. UK-based World Mobile aims to change this with an innovative solution. Using aerostats, tethered balloons, the company plans to launch a hybrid network, starting in Zanzibar, to provide extensive internet coverage. The solar-powered balloons, operating on 3G and 4G frequencies, will hover at 300 meters, offering a broadcast range of approximately 70 kilometers each. This project, following a successful $40 million funding round, aims to bridge digital divides and catalyze socio-economic development in Tanzania and beyond by connecting nearly 4 billion people online before 2030. Number 2. Kazungula Bridge, Zambia and Botswana In 2007, Zambia and Botswana initiated the Kazungula Bridge project to replace the ferry system connecting them. Funded by the Japanese International Cooperation Agency and the African Development Bank, the $259.3 million bridge was completed by Daewoo ENC in May 2021. 
Delays in opening were caused by pandemic-related transport issues. Beyond its 923-meter span, the Kazungala Bridge promises transformative impacts. It will accelerate trade by reducing travel times and fostering economic growth along the North-South Corridor. By 2024, increased tourism in areas like Chobe National Park is expected, benefiting local businesses and livelihoods. However, the bridge's significance extends beyond national borders. It is envisioned as a catalyst for regional integration, enhancing cross-border trade, knowledge sharing, and joint infrastructure projects. Number 1. Lekki Deep Sea Port, Nigeria The Lekki Deep Sea Port, Nigeria's largest seaport and a West African giant, comprises three terminals funded through a $1.5 billion collaboration between China Harbor Engineering Company and Tolaram Group. With a capacity to handle 4 million metric tons of dry goods annually, it promises efficiency, swift transit times, and reduced operational costs. Envisioning automated container systems and colossal ships, the port anticipates a revenue surge of $361 billion over 15 years, invigorating industries, attracting foreign investment, and creating 170,000 jobs. Beyond national borders, the Lekki port aspires to position Nigeria as a global maritime player, fostering economic prosperity and infrastructure development. Commencing operations in April 2023, it looks forward to full capacity in 2024, marking a new era of economic growth. Thank you for joining us on Africa InfoHub. Kindly stay informed, share your thoughts, and don't forget to subscribe for more nuanced perspectives on Africa's geopolitical landscape.